saw you at Cerulean Gym just out a rocky tunnel. It was the way you'd laugh and the way that you swim. I knew that you'd be trouble. We made such a big splash, big crash. You'll be my tidal wave. Breaks me down like an avalanche. Then we go dancing in the rain. Nasty, you're gonna miss me when I'm gone. I'm gone forever. Don't tease me, my heart is freezing. Cause you whipped up this icy weather. I'm talking in my Chances were slim that much, it's plain to see But I found you standing with him and thought It should have been me I had my chance and I blew it My closing hearts are right through it I'm coming down like a crash in a wake Messy, you're gonna mess me when I'm gone I'm gone forever Hello, dudes. My name is Thirteen, and welcome back to our Pokemon Sacred Gold Egglock. In the last episode, we took on the final gym leader of the game, Blue, and we hatched the remainder of the eggs as well as the remainder of our encounters. Now, as you saw, there was a lot of grinding. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna go over the squad here. I don't remember when it was. I was nearly done, actually. I trained up every one of these guys, and I had started working on the other uh, three, which are gonna be in the final squad probably for fighting red uh, I, I was training them all up and then the emulator just closed down the middle of it so I lost everything before toxic Oak. so basically I had to retrain up toxic Oak, and it's just like oh anyway it was frustrating but we're good here and we're gonna be taking on the Kanto uh, the the late four rematches so I trained everyone up to level 78 I didn't actually go over my team at all so let's do it First up, we have Power the Flygun, Holding Choice, Band Neutral Nature with Crunch Outrage, which he learned and I taught it to him because Bandit Outrage is going to hit like a truck, Earthquake, and Strength. Next up, we have Marty the, uh, the... Girafferig, I don't know why I forgot its name. With a naughty nature, holding the wise glasses, which all boost all special moves with Psychic, Energy Ball, Shockwave, and Nasty Plot. Next up, we have Venus the Cac... Ga not Cacta, Carnivine. Jeez, holding the expert belt with Seed Bomb, Crunch, Poison Fang, and Sleep Powder. Cannot learn Poison Jab. Sucks balls. Next up, we have Tiki, the uh, the the Toxic Rook with an Adamant Nature, holding the expert belt with Drain Punch, X Scissor, Bullet Punch, and Poison Jab. Then we have Ernest, the Charizard, one of our one of my favorite Pokemon on this squad here, with Fly, Flamethrower, Outrage, and Earthquake. And holding the expert belt, by the way, neutral nature. And finally, not fine. Yes, finally, we have Gray the Vaporeon here with Grass Knight, Yawn, Ice Beam, Surf, uh, Modest Nature, and Leftovers. So, pretty cool stuff. I just mainly got everyone up. Uh, Charizard 
I gave has both outrage and earthquake, which is pretty cool. Um, it's up power uh, outrage, and I believe that's the only difference I ended up making. I forget who's first. Uh, is it? It's Will. Okay, so we'll we'll lead out here with Venus, because Venus is a dark type. And let's just save up and get ready to go again. I'm an interest. I'm Will. I don't care what you said because we've already fought you. But I went and I checked, I don't even remember his first Pokemon, but I went and checked what the levels were. His first Pokemon he sent out was level 78, so I felt 78 was a decent level to train up to. Executor! Okay, I do not have, uh... X's are on this guy. I don't have X's on anybody, actually. Wow. Why did you think that would work? I mean, I don't... Actually, I forgot. The Potter moves do work on grass types in this generation. Alright, next up is Jinx. And you are a ice type, so I don't really want to risk that. I'd like to go into Ernest. Because Ernest is just my most safe bet. Because I can hit you hard with a flamethrower. And probably Oko. Nope. Ice Beam hurts, though. Anyway, goodbye. You're done, son. Next up is a Slowbro. Slow. But let's go into back into Venus. Venus will be the one to handle up, ah, well, Crunch is more powerful, but that'll hurt. Wow. Okay. Do you get- you actually get Flamethrower. That's crazy. Nope, no one's slower. I don't think Gardevoir gets really anything to touch Venus. So I'm just gonna heal up. You trace my Levitate, that's fine. I wasn't gonna use it. I was actually thinking of sending out Flygon, so that ended up working pretty nicely. You do get Focus Blast. Are we serious? Please don't kill me. It's a good thing I wasn't planning on bringing Venus into the final fight anyway. Fuck! Oh, you have X Scissor, Tiki. I forgot about that. Okay, anyway, what I wanted to calc and see was how much uh, X Scissor would do to this thing. So, it does less than half, and that's my issue here. I don't think it can one-shot power, and I think a Bandit Earthquake will take it out. Because power should outspeed, because I have a ton of EVs. Oh, I have Crunch. That'll kill. For sure. Bandit Crunch from a Flygon should kill. That sucks. We lost our... I mean, considering the rest of the Pokemon we have to face, Carnivine was the least important. Next up is a Bronzong. Okay. I'd like to be able to stay in here, but... We're going to Ernest. Um, we can see if you're going to be heat proof or levitate. You're going to raise. You're going to reflect. Okay, so let's go for flamethrower here. Should do a lot of damage. Okay, you are definitely levitate. I'll just swing through and kill you. Next up is a Zatu. All right, let's go into Marty. He's got Shockwave and all nasty plot. All right, this is your last Pokemon. They're gonna T-Wave me, that sucks. Heat wave, alright, we should be able to live that. Alright, that's actually perfect, because then you won't heal, if you would even. They're gonna heat wave me again, that's fine, we'll shockwave, and we beat Will. We did lose our Carnivine first try though. I can't believe it! At least it's at the end of the layout, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Even though it's defeated, I won't change my course. I'll continue battling until they stand above all trainers. Move on, experience two for us to hear the lead for. Sure. Sucks we lost Venus, but as I said, definitely the least important when it came to the Pokemon we were bringing in this time. Should we like to go to? We'll go to room two. I think it's Bruno. No, it's Koga. I keep forgetting. Marty. You're gonna have a Drapion, though. For, I am a Koga of the Elite, for I live in shadows a ninja! My angel gets that will come and and destroy you! You're viciously poisoned! If I had to be a victim, my sinister techniques- <laughs> Pokemon had merely a brute force, you shall see soon enough! I did buy three revives, and I'm allowed to use them. I just don't feel like using one on Carnivine, because I don't need Carnivine. Frankly. There's Koga. Alright, you're gonna lead all the Toxicroak. I love Toxicroak, actually. His cry is awesome. Alright, I should just be able to obliterate you. Sorry, buddy. I don't- I actually really wonder if- Even with the, uh... The Pattaya Berry, if it could've lived. 
Alright, next up is Skun Tank. We're gonna go into power, and we're gonna just earthquake this thing. I had to fight uh, Skun Tanks when I was training up Drapion and Infernape and Venusaur. Because there's a bunch of Skun Tanks over by Cerulean. So we're gonna earthquake your face in, and goodbye. Next up is a Muck. I'll stay in. Because Muck's good on the special offensive side, not so much physical. Power should actually handle this really nicely. There we go. Power, you're the GOAT. Next up is a Crobat. There you go. Making some smart moves this time. We're going to go back into Marty. Because uh, Marty can hit this thing. It has anticipation too. Brave Bird, that's going to hurt. I think I can live it though. Come on, Marty. Yes, Marty! Trevor is bulky than I give it credit for. This thing has lowered special defense, not physical defense, which is probably good. This thing, a lot of poison types are physical attackers. Next up is a Venomoth. You're a psychic bug. Which is funny, it, it being not a poison type at all anymore, that he made it a psychic bug type. Or that Koga still has it, I mean. Sweet. Next up is a Swallow. Swallow. I've been counting on this one for the very beginning. What can it do to me, actually? I don't think the crit mattered, but that was definitely overkill. And there we go, we beat Koga. Are you proving your worth? Thanks, Koga. I already fought you once, and I have Pokemon that are really good against poison types. So who is next? We have Bruno. I would like to lead up with Marty for him, too. Ernest and Marty will be really good for, um, Bruno. I really love Koga's room. It's so nice. I am Bruno of the Elite Four, brother. Are we straight to the extreme? Whatever. Let's battle. It's a rematch. I think Bruno was the only one I didn't lose a member against. Uh, because I ended up having to use all three of my revives, and then I had... Whatever. Okay. Does Hitmontop get anything? It doesn't... It shouldn't, right? Close combat shouldn't kill, either. Fake out. Okay. Hey! Marty, you're so damn good! I mean, I... I should give it credit. You got... I've got Stab, and I've got... Uh, super Effectiveness on my side, and it's Psychic. Alright, flame through your face. Goodbye. Sorry, Lucario. I love Lucario, but... Oh! I was gonna switch, but that's okay. We'll see what you're gonna do. Stone Edge! Oh, god damn it! Oh, no! Yeah. Well, that was a great thing to do. Good job, Caleb. Didn't mean to bullet punch again. I want a poison jab. Jeez. Alright, next up is Infernape. Power Earthquake him. Next up is a Hitmonchan. Let's go into Gray. Because Gray will be able to take his hits. I was going to say take his hits best, but no, he didn't. Power, get in there. Let's Outrage. <clears throat> You're ace. Fight as hard as you can until something. Dynamic Punch, ow. Why do you hit two Dynamic Punches in a row, you prick? Man, if I didn't lose any against him the first time, then I definitely, uh, he got his revenge. I'm using all of them right now. I need all of my good Pokemon. Venus isn't bad, I just don't need it for the this Elite Four. I probably could have trained up something that would have been more helpful in the Elite Four, but I didn't. And then finally is Karen. So a fighting type. We'll go take you out front. I'm Karen, you're talking about using I love dark types. Ooh, yeah. I know you do. Let's fight. A Weebot. Okay, you're gonna exert your pressure. I hate that, but. Whatever. Just goodbye. I have Bullet Punch. I should have Drain Punched again. Haunch Crow. Alright, let's go into gray here. Because I can Ice Beam you. You did- oh, okay, I'll take that freeze. 
It thought out first turn. Are you kidding me? That's absolute bullshit. Fuck you. I'm staying in because you have Psycho Cut. I don't know what I went for, but I missed. Houndoom. This would be great to have Gray right now. Son of a bitch. I'm going in. I'm going to be fighting Lance with four Pokemon. Alright, I'm just going to have to hit this thing super hard. Alright, we're not doing this. Sorry, buddy. Alright, fuck you, bro. What can you... Dude. I need to burn. Nope. Okay. Why did I send in Marty? That was such a stupid decision. Doesn't matter. Dude. I'm going into this fight with power. And Marty. I did not expect to get wrecked so hard this time in the Elite Four. I just didn't have a good team matchup. Damn, let's just, let's do it, let's get the fuck out of here. Let's go. <sighs> time for a rematch, Lance. We'll see what happens. I have a Choice Bandit Outrage. That's about all I got. Power's gonna be my saving grace. I've been waiting for you. Knew you with your skills eventually reach me here. We're gonna rebattle. Oh my goodness, bro. This is gonna be this is gonna suck. Alright, immediately swap. Aqua Tail. Great! Light orb, son of a bitch. I'm outraging everything. Fuck you. Holy shit! Come on, power. No! I could have done it! <laughs> I could have done it with power! No, he could have, and he not hit himself in confusion, bro. That one coin flip. Oh my gosh. That was a terrible run. I think that's the first time I've, like, ever actually failed the Elite Four. I'm swapping Venus out. I'm gonna bring a, uh, Pokemon that'd be better suited. Alright, I'll meet you back at Lance, because we're gonna beat him this time, and I'm actually going to... ...do my best to use literally Power and Marty, and, and, that, and that being it, against the, uh... Against Lance. I've been waiting for you. We're back. This time, I have Marty out here immediately to go for a nasty plot. And you get a crit. Fuck that noise. Thanks. Goodbye. Oh, you're gonna send out Tyranitar this time. Let's go into power. Power can withstand the earth, the, the sand. Nice. Next up is Garchomp. We're going to gray this time. I was gonna just use those gray only. Okay, so now he's got three left. So we're gonna let power handle this. Power gets to outrage the crap out of the last three. That's right. Banded, even with multi-scale, you're dead. You know what, let's see how much this does. I'm not sure what you can do to me. Yeah, it's expected. Okay, that's fun. So just hit you hard with a poison jab. That's fine. I don't know why you'd use that. That doesn't make any sense to me. Whatever. Strength, goodbye. Power did it. We did it. Anyway. <sighs> 
It become truly powerful. Yep, we beat him. Whatever. I don't know why they do the same same thing. This is the second time I've done this. Like, whatever. Marty the Giraffe Rig, Power the Flygon, Hatched on Route 10. Tiki, Hatched on Saffron City. Gray, Obtain in a Fateful Encounter. Ernest, hatched at Violet City. I hatched you- oh yeah, never mind. I was gonna say that far back, but yeah, it was one of those eggs that I found. Hatched at Mahogany. He got- Drapion got his second badge. <laughs> and there we go. A repeat. Alright. So, that's actually about it for this episode, guys. Really hope you enjoyed it. Like, appreciated. The next episode, we will be taking on Red. Going through Mount Silver and taking on Red. At least that's the plan, so... Yeah, I'll see you then.